Good afternoon everybody. Calm bike here. Just heading home after finishing off the uh, perimeter of East Yorkshire for my East Yorkshire Lanes Challenge. I noticed as I was uh, finishing that piece, it was in my last video, I uh, had to go down a lane and I noticed there was one just to the side of it. And I thought, I wonder, I wonder if that goes anywhere. Actually where it turned out to go was um, just off the road and back on again. I thought I'd go and have a look, so I went through there and it was this little tiny lane that's obviously not used anymore because it's only maybe 50 yards alongside the um, the road that I was actually going down on that, that proper route. So I went and filled that one in anyway, it's another one ticked off the list and I thought I'll just, uh, as I head home, I'll just, yeah, one finally didn't just barge the way through, look. I thought I'd just record another little video to tell you about something I've been playing with. I complained the other day, I had a bit of a rant about AI, I was particularly talking about the ChatGPT style large language model at the time, which is a form of generative AI. So unlike the AI stuff that I've done in the past where it's kind of analysing things and looking for patterns and predicting the future, generative AI just generates stuff. Text can be one of them, which is what I was mainly talking about. But you can also do audio, so you can do songs, and you can do pictures, and you can do videos. And I thought, well, I've been talking about it, I might as well have a bit of a chuckle. A friend of mine sent me a, a bit of music that he generated with AI. It was actually quite good, although it suffers from the standard problem that they all suffer from, that... Um, they are, on the surface, they are quite convincing, but then when you kind of scratch beneath the surface, or scratch off the surface, whatever the phrase is that I can't quite remember at the minute, um, but yeah, when you, uh, when you look a bit deeper, you realise that actually there's a lot of errors, there's a lot of stuff that doesn't quite make sense. I thought, well... I've got a video channel, let's have a, a look at what it can do with video. So I got onto a, a site called Luma Dream Machine, which is one of the video generators. So it's an AI video generator where you can type in a prompt, um, and it creates a video that matches that prompt. So I thought video fits with the fact that I've got a video channel, also it's the one that generates the most data. So it's the one that's most likely to have the most errors, which can be very, very funny. Now, it took a long time to generate the video I'm about to show you. It's 22 five second clips. I wanted it to be more, but I got bored of waiting for things. The five second clips, it would only let me do two at a time, and some of them took four days to generate. So it's not exactly fast. So I thought, I'll share it with you see if you can spot any of the errors and it's not a mistake on my part, part that there's a five second bit where there doesn't appear to be a lot of movement that's because for that one it decided movement was optional in video <laughs> so have a look let me know in them there comments what you think thanks for watching everyone ride safe and i'll talk to you all again soon